good 540 game. So you know it's your boy Chris at Game Mr. 540, 540 TV in the building. We got a special video for you today. Actually, it's an unboxing of something that I've seen on Amazon that I've always wanted to try and uh, really install. But here's our package. And after the intro, we're going to get into it. All right. LeBron James, LeBron James. What's good, everybody? Know what it is. Oh. I'm in London. I mean, it's just more questions you have to ask me. Still ten toes down the road, Melissa. He ran out on the that's a shout out, shout out. Cold hearted, go with the block, I block out. Gotta keep it on me, I wanna die young. I'd rather be judged by 12 than carried by six. I'ma go post bail, just look at my wrist. Tell me why the legends always gotta die quick When I'm in traffic, gotta slide with the beam on me Cause I keep my t rex busting and not the jeans on me so We got our package here um, I did take my address off because I don't want, you know Everybody just showing up my address But we're gonna go ahead and open this bad boy up See Amazon um, The link of this will be in the description Yes, sir. So with this, I'm able to unlock my uh, front door with my phone. I don't necessarily need this, but hey, I got it. Might as well install it. Everything's out the bag. You know what we're going to do with this? You know, we just toss that all out the way. So we're going to open it. There's a Bluetooth keyless access, turbo lock, TL99. Um, you can set up to 300 passcodes, Bluetooth capability, um, multi-user e-keys. So that's going to open it up. So we got our manual. Of course, you know, got to have your manual. Do not tug the cord through the handle. All right. And so here's our unit. got our unit here um it looks pretty dope looks pretty cool i'm just ready to see how it's gonna work um and everything so let's see what else we got i know that there is a battery pack um we gotta get some batteries to put in here batteries going here and also it goes in this part of the door handle <clears throat> Uh, this is just for if um, the batteries die in the um, turbo lock. You can use this as like a temporary battery pack to uh, power on the lock to put the code in. So, which is pretty dope. So, it's like, you know, you'll never ever be locked out your house. You know, because, you know, we thinking, okay, put batteries in, they're going to soon die. Yeah. Um, but at least you have this to kind of get in as a backup, so. All right, let's get to the installation. All right, we are back. I'm um, gonna get to our first step, which is removing our old door handle. I've already removed the screws out of here, and I've removed the screws out the back here. So this right here pretty much should come off. So that's that. And this should come right out. All right, so what we're gonna do right now is pretty much take um, this door handle apart because it's, the screws are already in. So we need to actually take all the screws out. So we're gonna start with this side here. And let's make sure we keep up where, where the screws go. So 
So this is the compartment where the battery will be to give your doorbell power. All right. So now we're gonna stick our screwdriver through these holes here to get to these two screws. So installing this, just remember, you know, what you're doing. You're gonna go in the forward motion or forward action, because we're pretty much taking it apart, so we're going to reverse. Let's see these out. Let's go ahead and unloose this so we see that this goes here. This is for our battery. And there is a reset button on the back in case you forget your code. It'll just wipe your codes out on your um, door handle. I hope I didn't say doorbell earlier, but your door handle and also your app. Almost there. All right, that should be loose. And I like to try to do these things real time so you all can be doing them with me. You know, some people just like go to the next scene and don't tell you how they did what they did. All right, so we got those, matter of fact, let's just leave those screws on. This is actually what came off, but we're gonna put that back on also and put the screw back in there. Well, that was a fail. Let's try to line it up here. There we go. All right, we're gonna keep that all together as one piece. So now we need to take this apart and this should just slide right off. And you see that line kind of fishes through. Like that. So you know when we put the doorbell on, we're gonna do the same thing. All right, let's get to the door and let's try to install this. All right, now that we got um, everything dismantled as far as the new um, door handle, door lock system, we're gonna go ahead and grab this piece here Make sure that the ridge here is facing outside. So just slide it right on in. Let's go ahead and put our screws in. That's one. And make sure to the best of your ability that um, this plate is lined up to where the original plate was. Now, if you have a brand new do brand new door, um, you have to make your own markings. But all right, so we're good to go on that. All right, our next piece is the one with the uh, code. So of course we're gonna feed this through. We're gonna do that first. All right, so that's going through. All right. So let's see how it look on the outside here. I mean, that looks high tech. And we all gonna repaint my door, so don't worry about the paint marks. So we got that on. Next, what we're gonna do, gonna grab our next pieces here. Um, of course, we're gonna feed um, the wire through here.
Let's make sure that that's correct. I was supposed to go sideways. So I'm gonna show you what I'm actually looking at here. So the screws has a screw on these two sides here. Um, so we gotta make sure that it lines up. There we go. I'm gonna drop you all down some. All right. Let's get our screwdriver. We're gonna look through here and just screw everything in. That's one screw in. All right, we're inside the next hole. All right, got that screw in. So we got our batteries, triple A's is what it takes. One battery in, the next battery in. And it looks like four more going this side here. So let's see if we can get it slid off of here. All right, so let's grab two more. We actually just got enough batteries. I actually only thought it took um, two, but this will definitely give it more battery life. Battery pack installed. Um, the last thing we need to do is actually just put the back plate on and the battery pack actually has holes that lines up with the holes of this here and this is going to line up with that same hole all right let's take our screws this was the first thing we did dismantling let me get my screwdriver It definitely feels heavy duty. Right here isn't actually a needed part of the video, but since we got um, our new plate, with our new thing, we're just gonna go ahead and take the old one off. And we're gonna use the same screws that came out of here.
That is done. Outside of my door, we're gonna close the door so you see everything locks as soon as you close it. The default code is one, two, three, four, five, six pound. All right, so that works. So it seems like um, you have to just kind of hit a number to get it started. So. All right, let's try it again. So I don't know what the deal is with the one, two. All right, so I guess after a while, um, cause I guess the, with the batteries, it cuts itself off. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, two, three, four, five, six pound. Yep, so I guess hit the pound to kind of re reset it and then it'll get itself back together. But from the inside, it just opens normally. Then from this side, we got it closed. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. So on to our next step, which is entering a new password. First, what we're gonna do is um, enter the default administrator password, which is one, two, three, four, five, six pound. Next step, enter one pound. Then our new administrator password, pound. Re-enter the password again, pound. And then wait for the bat light to go off, which will tell you that you your password is actually saved. All right, then we're gonna test the password. Um, your key password has to be five digits at least. The default password is six, but it has to be at least five digits. I, I won't show uh, my password, but let's go ahead and get started. So one, two, three, four, five, six, pound, one, pound. All right, let's try to enter our new password. I won't show y'all my new password, but you're gonna hear it. So keypad is on. So my new password worked. All right, everybody, so that's the end of the video. Uh, we finally got our um, new door handle, more modern um, type of door handle done. So make sure y'all like, subscribe, hit the post notification to get all notifications every time I upload. I just do crazy stuff. There's no need for the door handle, but hey, I like the door handle, so it is what it is. Peace.